back, Desmond. You'll be happy to hear there's actually good news for once. Yeah? I've managed to locate a power source, and it's relatively close by. Up for a trip to Manhattan? Is it safe to leave? Abstergo's gotta be looking for us. Obviously it's not safe. Can't exactly sit around here hoping to get lucky, though, can we? We need that power source. Besides, I'm sure you can cook up some way to hide our movements. Maybe. The Templars have access to all kinds of satellites and camera systems. We'll need to find a way to mask our digital signature. I can probably camouflage the van, too. But there's not much I can do for us. That's an easy one. Local utility companies have assured the public that they're completely prepared for the upcoming solar maximum. Disruptions to service are expected to be minimal. If only they knew. What's this? A remote-operated camera. It'll provide us with a feed while you're on mission. This will let us talk to each other. We're almost there, so listen up. The artifact is in an office penthouse in Lower Manhattan. At this time of night, direct infiltration is gonna get you noticed. I think we're better off having you drop in from above. What do you mean, above? Testing, one, two, three. Yep, reach you just fine. Now why don't you power up the camera? I've got pictures, running diagnostics. Perfect, I've got a nice strong signal. Just a heads up, there's no elevator access from here on out. You'll have to get up there the old fashioned way. Seriously, Sean? Fuck you. Jesus. Look on the bright side. No security to worry about. And on the not so bright side, the slightest misstep means you're effectively at the paste. Shut up, Sean.
there, Desmond. Once you reach the top of the lit up crane, you should be high enough to make the jump. Should? It'll be fine, don't worry. Well, you might want to worry a little. I'm pretty sure she was high when she was running the numbers. Sean! Joke. It was a joke. Or was it? Wasn't so bad. So, you must be Desmond. Not exactly what I expected, but I guess your kind doesn't have many options these days. Who are you? Ask your father. Now give me that. I don't think so. Look, I'm not supposed to kill you, but the boss man didn't say anything about fucking you up. So you got to the camp. So who the hell is Daniel Cross? Believe it or not, he used to be an assassin. The assassin, the way I've heard it told, but it turned out he was a sleeper agent for Abstergo, programmed to infiltrate and destroy the organization. How did he know you were there? We could be compromised. They must have caught me snooping inside their network and sent Cross to see what we were after. If they were aware of our current location, we'd know. Though, I will say this, it doesn't bode very well for future expeditions. I've set up some cameras topside. If anyone shows up, we'll see it. I'd suggest you go see about finding a socket for that power source. Or we can return to Connor if you prefer. All the artifacts in the world won't mean a thing without the key. sought to face the sun's wrath and contain it. Four towers would be built to pull her fury into this place and dispel it. But even with all we knew, with all we had, it would take too long. A thousand years we could labor and still the work would not be done. The first tower was never completed. The project abandoned. We moved on. But while we labored on other endeavors, a few returned. They thought to automate the process. Metal might finish what flesh could not. Thank you. 
if we could not meet the sun's cruel embrace. Perhaps we might rebuke it. Already we could generate the fields to protect us in times of strife. But these were small and simple things. To replicate them on a scale the size of a world. We lack the energy to make it so. Half the world, they said then. It is better than none at all. We tried. Again, we failed. A quarter, they asked. Even this we could not do. A sixth, an eighth, a tenth, they cried. The answer was still the same. Perhaps in time a city might be spared. But it was time we did not have. So we moved on. I wonder what's inside. Only one way to find out. <laughs> 